Good morning, TikTok. It's 11.55 a.m. And uh, I got a, uh, um, I got a, uh, what do you call that? A conference call coming with some other attorneys and this arbitration that I got coming on. You know, my client got me late. They got rid of their old attorney and they brought me in late. And so, you know, I've had to learn this case in like a week, right? To learn this case in a week, which means that I've had to talk to the client, got to look through all the documents while running the rest of my business and doing all the other stuff, including the podcast and the drama that goes on the podcast. But in any event, dude, I just wanted to get on here and just kind of give you an insight, right? My wife who is also my law partner, is getting me some acupuncture. I have to fill out all these stupid-ass forms for acupuncture, right? And it's like medical history and check these boxes, and it's all like Google forms, so you're clicking through all that nonsense. And um, it'll be the first time I ever get acupuncture. So they'll be sticking needles and stuff in me. And, 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 and I'm just going to tell the world, right? Look, I'm a nicotine fiend. That's true. I've been chewing tobacco since I was about five years old growing up on the reservation. Big kids gave it to me. They said, don't throw up, you little punk. And I don't know what it was. It was beech nut in the foil pouch. And I don't know what it was. But I loved it. I loved it. Instantly. Not only did the big kids throw up on the bus, but uh, I didn't throw up. Not only did I not throw up, but I realized I had met my soulmate which is chewing tobacco. And yes, I did chew the racist red mat. In fact, I was proud of it. I was like, yeah, Indian. And um, it's gotten to the stage now where I do the nicotine pouches, right? The sterilized pouches. But my wife is like, you're a father now, dude. And I know she's right. But then part of me is like, I don't drink. I don't eat meat. I, I don't even drink diet soda. Can I just please have this one? You know, and this is, of course, addicted thinking, but I'm like, can't I just have one vice? What's the point? <laughs> this is how sick my thinking gets. It's like, what's the point of living if I can't do something bad? <laughs> so, you know, she's tolerated it, but she's hoping that this acupuncture session is going to, you know, I don't know what. The needles are going to pinch a nerve that's going to knock something loose. But I'm not, you know, fuck it. I'm going to explore. I'm going to try it. And I'll uh, tell you guys what it was like afterwards. All right, bye.